Looks pretty dang solid. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Nice. So, just counting them up. We did not miss any, which is super exciting. So that would be three deltas and twelve charlers. That would be a score of. 18 off so that'd be a 282 all right so we just looked at the camera it was actually 87 seconds so broke that 90 second threshold that we want for the elite rifle roundup super pumped about that one of my better scores so hey put in the reps you crush it oh what kind of advice would i give for guys trying to get to this level of shooting to get that fast. yeah i would say focus on the fundamentals focus on the fundamentals all we're doing is standing kneeling prone right but we're adding in stress and speed and distance. Most people don't ever shoot at 100 yards, right? So if you focus on your fundamentals like we just did yesterday at the confirmation course, you will for sure gain the skills necessary to absolutely crush this drill. But if you just do all sexy high speed stuff up close, you're never gonna get there, right? Yep. Yeah. You going? All right, so. We're gonna do a little flow training now, what I like to call it. Kind of like a yoga flow, but a tactical flow. So we got a 12 inch steel plate out there. I'm gonna shoot it from 100, 75, and 50. And I'm gonna go nice and steady pace, hopefully no misses. Two hits standing, two hits kneeling, two hits prone, move to 75. Two, 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 move to 50, two, two, two. Just basic marksmanship stuff to a pretty decent standard, 12 inch plate, and then not really worried about time, just moving my body, trying to get into quality positions. So let's try it out. Woo! There we go. Struggled right there. There we go. All right, got to clean up that standing. Much better. Not bad. Struggle at the hundred, so next time I'm gonna clean that up. What you think you made at the Russian, just not really confirming that sight picture. 12 inch plate at 100 is getting tight for me at least, so just getting the reticle close and trying to send it to be cool on camera, right? Instead of ensuring that reticle is nice in the center of that target. So we'll fix it. This is why we train. All right, round two. Go ahead, say one. Three, two, one. All right, cleaned it that time.
All right. All right. Nailed it that time. That was awesome. Woo! Fully focused. Wasn't lazy about it. Simple as that. All right, so we're going to do this one more time. Second run, got it all clean. So this time I'm going to try to pick up the speed. See where we're at. Let's do it. Yeah, let's push some speed. Ooh, always check the status. Only had one round in the mag. That wouldn't be good when I'm going into this tactical scenario with these steel targets. <laughs> All right. Ready. Rush that second shot. There we go. Picked up the speed a little bit. A few misses, but not too bad. Yeah, so screwed up one of the prone shots at 100, right? Should be the easiest ones. But when trying to push speed, I feel more confident in the prone. So I was like, ah, oh, reticle's close enough. Not close enough, not close enough. So got to confirm that sight picture or we're going to miss like that. All right, let's do it. All right, let's go, one more. All right. There we go. So what we're doing right now is working our positions from a sprint, right? You're probably never gonna use these skills just getting into the position on the static range. So gets the heart rate up, really stresses your target acquisition. Getting into position with the rifle is just like the pistol draw. Everybody wants their pistol draw to be sub one second, right? And be perfect and sexy, but nobody works on running 10 yards and diving into the prone. So very, very important. All right, we're going to do kneeling. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Easy day. Nice. Ah, solid, but just off to the right. Ooh, should have taken more time in that second round. All right, ready. Yeah, took a little more time. Got the hits easy that time. 
How are you keeping making those adjustments? And How do you keep focused? And, yeah. Go to the gym. <laughs> <laughs> Simple as that. Be fit. All right. Turn and shoot, too. Oh, solid. Whoo! Ah, it was fast, but one off. Oh, that was sexy. 176. Oh, let's just go for a max speed. That was about 95%. So I'm just gonna try to whip this thing around and send it. Whew. All right. Oh yeah, 172, so three hundredths faster. All right, faster. Ah! Second one just over top. All right, let's go that speed, but hit the damn thing. Oh yeah, woo, let's show them the target. All right, so all day we've been running on either our paper targets for the cold start, so we're accountable for every round, but I'm running on this 12 inch steel. Is it even 12 inches? I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, about Two hands the size, so aim small, miss small, right? Yeah. <laughs> right? 